This review of the h 2 Audio Amphibix Waterproof Armband and Surge Bass Amplified Waterproof Headphones is brought to you by BuyMeAnIPhone.com. First off, I have to say that I've had a blast using the H2O products and definitely using them has brought a whole new experience to my water activities. Before I get into a more in-depth review, here are some brief facts about the Surge and Amphibix. Alright, so I wanted to start off by going over the Amphibix waterproof armband. Now most of the facts that I'm going to be going over is going to be coming directly from the packaging or the H2O Audio website. So let me just take the armband out of the packaging here. Included with the packaging you're also going to get this step-by-step -step picture instruction just going over how to properly insert your device into the armband. And I wanted to mention that besides the very appealing packaging that H2O Audio has, uh, it also has this very clever section here on the back where you're able to place your device into this area to check if it's compatible with the sizing of the armband. So if your device can fit within the dimensions of this box that is provided, then your, uh, your um, product is in fact compatible, which is really nice for us consumers knowing before we buy the armband that our product will in fact fit. So going over the armband itself, this provides a 100% watertight secure seal up to 12 feet which translate to 3.6 meters underwater. The adjustable strap here fits practically any arm size. It is completely adjustable and accessible. Uh, you're able to pull it completely tight or you can even, and this is it being uh, the looser size, or you can even take this entire strap out and s string it through this area here to make it even tighter for those of you who have smaller arms. What's really neat is that on the H2O Audio website I found an area where you can purchase a waist extension belt and what that is is a um, belt that extends the strap on the armband allowing it to be worn around your back, your waist, your hips, really great for paddlers or swimmers so that wearing it around your arm won't obstruct any movement that you might need to do. Back to the front here, the clear touch window enables full operation of touch and even very accessible for those click wheel controls. It was totally responsive for me, never gave me any problems. Uh, responsive both out or in the water which is really nice and over here we have the area where you can insert your device and seal tight and this seal tight connector here which is compatible with your standard 3.5 millimeter headphone plugs which will bring me to HUL's next product which is the Surge Bass Amplified Waterproof Headphones so included in the packaging besides the earphones itself is this carrying case which you can place the earphones into which seems to be made out of the same or similar material as the Amphibix armband as well as five different earplugs sizes which is just to provide a more individualized fit and watertight seal. These earphones are acoustically engineered for exceptional clarity and bass. And here at the bottom is a motion flex strain relief connector which is a standard 3.5 millimeter jack. As for the actual fit of the armband, although I found it to be a bit bulky in size and slightly heavy, which using the iPhone probably added to that, the fit was actually really nice as it stayed snug to my arm the entire time and accessing the touch window was a breeze as all I had to do was look over to my shoulder, change the song, increase the volume and I was good to go. Which brings me into the next product which is the Surge 
fast amplified waterproof headphones. These things are amazing. Besides the exceptional sound quality, which made every song I listened to sound completely clear and crisp, it kind of also doubled as earplugs as when I took them off my ears were completely dry and that is of course thanks to the five different sizes to choose from making it very form-fitting and watertight which I also want to mention on the armband itself this area here where you plug in the earphones you're going to want to make sure that if you're not using the H2O audio uh, earphones then you're going to want to make sure that the area here where the jack is that yours is straight like these and not curved or angled in any way as the only type will, that will fit into this connector is the ones that are straight. Other than that, this product does its job exceptionally well. I never once found any type of water or moisture in the waterproof pouch and the only drawback, which was a quite a, of a big one, was this very narrow area here where you used to insert your devices. As you can see in this clip here, inserting my iPod Nano was not a problem. I just plugged in the audio jack to be able to receive sound through my earphones and it slipped in really nicely. However, trying to fit my phone in through was really difficult. And although the products are compatible, I wouldn't recommend using your iPhone unless you're willing to risk scratching up the device as the insertion area on the armband is made out of hard plastic. And finally, just a few things I hope to see changed or implemented in future designs. It's possibly an area on the armband where you'll be able to wrap the extra cordage around from your earphones or even an attachment to the surge earphones where you can clip the earphone cord onto an article of clothing. And other than that, just an overall improvement of design, a little less bulky, a little more sleek, and maybe throw in a few more color options. Overall, I'm definitely going to continue using both of these products and would absolutely recommend them to my friends as well as all of you. You can find out more information as well as purchase these products at h2oaudio.com. Until next time, I'm Passion with buymeaniphone.com.